What if I told you that an island paradise harbors a complex decades-long conflict? Yes, I'm talking about Cyprus. To fully understand the intricate relationship between Cyprus and Turkey, we must journey back to 1974. It was in this year that a military intervention by Turkey dramatically altered the landscape of Cyprus, splitting it into two entities, the Republic of Cyprus and the Turkish Republic of Northern Cyprus. However, the roots of this conflict burrow far deeper than this single event. They are woven into the historical tapestry of the island, intertwined with cultural, geopolitical, and even personal narratives that span centuries. This is a tale not just of nations and politics, but of people, traditions, and identities. It's a saga that has seen the rise and fall of empires, the shifting of borders, and the enduring quest for autonomy and recognition. In order to fully grasp the situation, we need to delve into the cultural and ethnic dynamics of the island. Cyprus is a mosaic of different ethnic groups, each with their own unique identity and culture. The island's rich tapestry is woven with threads from Greek and Turkish Cypriots, each group distinct, yet intertwined in this shared space. These two ethnic groups, though living on the same island, carry with them their own unique languages, traditions, and customs. This diversity, while a source of richness, has also been a source of tension and conflict. The Greek Cypriots, who represent the majority, and the Turkish Cypriots, a significant minority, have often found their cultural identities at the heart of their disputes. Issues related to language, religious practices, and cultural traditions have fueled disagreements and misunderstandings between them. Yet, beneath these differences lie shared experiences and a common love for their island home. Now that we understand the cultural backdrop, let's examine the geopolitical factors at play. Geography is destiny, they say. And in the case of Cyprus, its strategic location has definitely shaped its destiny. Nestled in the eastern Mediterranean, Cyprus sits at a crossroads of continents and cultures. This location, while rich in history and beauty, also makes it a focal point of geopolitical tensions. Cyprus is blessed with abundant energy resources, particularly natural gas, making it a gem in the rough seas. These resources, however, have sparked maritime disputes over exclusive economic zones, further fueling the conflict between Cyprus and Turkey. The island's strategic location also plays into regional alliances. Cyprus is a member of the European Union, yet it's in close proximity to the Middle East. This creates a complex web of relations, with the EU, Turkey, and other regional powers, all having stakes in the island's future. Despite these tensions, there are efforts towards finding common ground. As we venture into the next segment, we'll explore these attempts at reconciliation. In the midst of the conflict, there are glimmers of hope for peace and reconciliation. Enter our expert on the subject. With extensive knowledge in international relations, provides valuable insights into the diplomatic initiatives and peace talks that aim to bridge the divide between Cyprus and Turkey. These processes, though often arduous and complex, represent the relentless pursuit of a peaceful resolution. From high-level negotiations to grassroots community dialogues, these efforts are a testament to the collective desire for harmony. Believes that, despite the historical and geopolitical hurdles, there is a path forward through dialogue, understanding, and mutual respect. These reconciliation efforts may be a slow burn, but they are the stepping stones towards a future where the people of Cyprus and Turkey can coexist peacefully. While diplomacy does its part, What's the impact of this conflict on the people of Cyprus? Behind the headlines and political disputes, there are real people living their everyday lives. Imagine waking up each day in a divided island, where the very nature of your identity is a subject of contention. This is the reality for the inhabitants of Cyprus, where the unresolved conflict has become a part of their daily lives. People navigate through a landscape marked by checkpoints and border controls. The physical division of the island has led to a dichotomy in the lives of its residents, Greek Cypriots in the south and Turkish Cypriots in the north. This impacts everything from their commute to work, 
to their ability to visit family and friends on the other side of the divide. The economic implications are also significant. Businesses grapple with the complications of operating in an environment where regulations, trade agreements and even currency differ on either side of the buffer zone. The tourism industry, a major driver of the island's economy, has been particularly impacted. With potential visitors deterred by the political instability, many businesses face an uphill struggle to survive. Yet, amidst these challenges, there's a resilient spirit that permeates the island. People continue to live, work, and dream. They strive to maintain a sense of normalcy while holding on to the hope for a peaceful resolution. In the markets, cafes and schools, life goes on. Children learn about their shared history while elders pass down stories of a time when the island was united. There's a longing for a future where identity doesn't divide, but rather enriches their shared culture. The conflict has also fostered a sense of community and solidarity. People come together to support local businesses, share their experiences, and advocate for peace. They participate in bi-communal activities, demonstrating their ability to coexist and their desire for reconciliation. These are the people behind the headlines, living their lives in the shadow of a conflict that has lasted for decades. Their resilience, hope and desire for peace are a testament to the human spirit. So where does this leave us when we look to the future? The Cyprus-Turkey conflict is a complex web of history, culture and geopolitics. Reflecting on the narratives we've explored, we see a tapestry of ethnic identities, a strategic island embroiled in geopolitical tensions, and a people yearning for peace amidst the uncertainty. This intricate saga, which began back in 1974, continues to shape the lives of Greek and Turkish Cypriots alike. The cultural disparities and language barriers, coupled with the strategic importance of Cyprus in the Eastern Mediterranean, have fueled this ongoing discord.